Have you ever heard of the saying, ain't no wedding like a Nigerian wedding? Cause uh, yeah, you get my point. Because when it comes to weddings, Nigerians know they carry last. I mean, I show okay, customize. Gele, a little bit tight, but always looking beautiful. Of course, the groom is beautiful and dapper to match. And that show be Bellas, oh, they do the most. They do, but we love that. So today we have an amazing woman who is literally one of the godmothers when it comes to Ashoke, Ashoebi, and everything weddings right here in Nigeria. She's been sprinkling her magic on all these beautiful brides, making their day a little bit special. And she's the CEO of BIMS24, Abimbola Ipaye. And we have her right here on The Fashion Insider. I'm your host, Sika Ose. A bimbola. Hi, babes. And you, you told me to say your full name, yes. you know, just we can get the, the ginger in it. And apart from the ginger, my, my name says a lot. It means a lot of things to me. So Does it? Yeah, Tell us what your name means to you. My name is a bimbola. That means I'm born with wealth. Yeah, that's the, uh, my darling. Can I just? Yeah. I, you can. The, the sure you can even the see blessings. It all, you, you can even see all around me. So you I can't know, see it all you around know, you. you. Don't. It's been an amazing journey super super amazing i don't have anything to complain, complain about, about. Um, what do you think has contributed to that journey and has made you as successful as you are and you're what six years into the business yep. you're still very young very young very young very so young. what do you think has been the reasons behind why bims 24 is where where you are now but um i can remember vividly when i was young i've always wanted to be successful yeah and you know while growing up um, I don't watch TVs, I don't do a lot of stuff. Yeah. And um, the only thing I used to listen to then was CNN, NTA, and you know, because whenever I'm watching these newscasters, I'm always saying, oh, I can't wait to be famous like yes. this person. But I didn't even know what I was gonna do. I don't know what my journey was gonna be. I wanted to be an ambassador so bad. I wanted wow. to be a diplomat so bad. I was looking forward to working for the UN so mm. bad. That was why I picked the course I did in uni and you know, I just feel like, I looked at where I was coming from and I made up my mind that yeah, I'm not going to give up. Yes. People think I'm very, I'm very truthful. People don't like people that are truthful. Mm. Mm -mm, people don't, people don't like, they, they either call us rude or whatever, whatever, but I'm very truthful. And in, in business, it's very important to be truthful, not only to yourself, to, to your customers, so they can build a trust with you, right? And that's part of my secret, being truthful. That's right. People walk into my store and they say, oh, Bims, what do you think? Mm. Should I do full show okay, or should I buy a lace and do just a billion gilly? Yeah. I'll tell you how it is. That's right. My, I show okay, you might probably not want it anymore. Mm. I need that money I'm sending away. But guess what? I'm still going to be truthful. Yes. But buying a lace and doing it really and is what you can afford. We're taking it like that. But I'm going to take you back to wearing a showcase. The main reason why I want you to wear an ashoke is someone can walk into your party and wear the same lace you're wearing on your wedding day. So it's not left for you. I've given you an insight. It's not left for you to pick whatever it is you That's want to right. pick. I mean, I know you said, you know, you're not very much into the money and things like that. But this this business is making you money, isn't like it? Money, money. You like money. I can no, see that. Everybody likes anything. Yeah. Because this is the thing is, I'm not 100% into money. Okay. But I need the money. Yes, now. You must live. I'm, I'm a slave. <laughs> <laughs> you think all Give of them. Give them. You think all of Give this. them. Because guess what? I'm coming from where I never used to have. That's right. I'm coming from where I used to borrow. Yes. I'm coming from where I'm not even sure of my next meal. To I'm all not, of this. I'm not going to take this for granted. That's right. That's why money is nothing to me. But I was going to ask, has money changed you? No. I'm still the same person. So tell us, what is the secret? And, and not, we want the real secrets. The real okay. insider, you know, trade insider information. Okay. Um, um, I'm going to tell you the real secret. Okay. I'm going to start with, do I get tense? Yes. yes. Okay. Do I want to give up? Yes. yes, but the main secret that kept me here mm. is number one, I've learned to be content with whatever position I'm in. Mm. I decided to bring something new to the table and I'm not going to stop bringing something new to the table. Yeah. No matter how competitive the 
marketers. Gotcha. Because I still want my name to be reading on everybody's lips. The last one is, I won't say, I'm very truthful. I won't say my competitors and my friends. No. Okay. Because the thing is, we can't be fighting for the same parcel and you think I'm your, your friend. friend. No, I'm not your friend. Mm -mm. Okay. We are colleagues. Okay. I'm not fighting with you. That's right. I don't have any beef for you. Mm -hmm. I don't have anything. Well, okay. You, don't want, you can't be my best friend. Got you. You can't. So this whole, oh, we can still be friends and still be in the same, I don't know, you don't I, think that I don't works. know how to pretend because the thing is, the moment we become friends, we either start talking about other people doing the same business. Got you. And then the same process, you will want to learn, you want to pick one or two things. Oh, Beams, how are you doing this? I'm not going to teach you how I bake my bread. Yes. I can advise you on what to do about your business. Got you. Why? Because uh, the world is funny. People try to get close to you just to pick one or two things from yeah. you. And the next thing you hear is, oh, I trained her. Oh, she trained under me. So I don't leave space for that. Got you. Moving on. This is definitely a, like an entrepreneur that's like diversifying yeah. because you can't just do one thing. You mm. must put your hands in different parts. Yes. But you know, a lot of people see you and think, you know what? Bims is making it. She has so much money because she has celebrity clients. She has a lot of, you know, big people wearing her stuff. Even the vice president's wife, Bims, you know, do you want to just, right uh, just give them, is wearing your beautiful showcase. And, and I mean, there's so many people. How does that make you feel? I would count that as a blessing. Yeah. And um, there's a part in the Bible that says when you're diligent in what you're doing, mm. because I believe God sees your heart. Yeah. So I would say dressing the vice president, have I ever thought about that? No. But I'm always saying to myself that, oh, I can't wait. I can't wait to dress the president of the United States of America. I'm always saying that even before, even before I got to dress Buari's daughter, I got to dress the VP and his wife. So I can't even wait to dress the president of the United States States of America. America. I don't know what he's going to be doing. I don't know maybe when he comes to Nigeria. <laughs> That's right. When he comes to because in the process, I, I'm almost there. Yeah. Because I, I was I was I was traveling sometime and my flight got cancelled and. I wasn't, for some funny reason, I wasn't upset and I was just, I just sat down. Everybody was making noise at the airport as usual. I said, what came to me? Why are you not talking? I said, you're already doing it for me. Like, mm. everybody can be mad at the same time. Yeah. And on getting back to my hotel, I got a call that I need you to dress someone and I need it in 48 hours. I was like, that's okay, friend, I'm going to come straight to you. They didn't tell you who the person was? The person, I was like, when I said, huh? I was like, I'm going to come straight to you. I want you, I want you to, to dress T.D. Jakes. I was like, what? I said, God, you cancel a flight of almost 200 and something because if I'd been on that flight, I wouldn't have gotten that call. My hands are shaking. You know, <laughs> if I'd been on that flight, I wouldn't have gotten that call. You're known as the queen of embroidery when it comes to Ashoke, okay, just adding your bedazzlement mm -hmm. and things like that. Where did that idea come from? And tell me about this whole thing about every Ashoke having a story. When I read that, I was like, wow, okay. You said there's, there's a story behind so, every, every Ashoke. Ashoke. Yeah, there's a story behind everything I've created. Yes. Yeah. Start to me is creating a lot of things out of nothing. Start to me is walking into a room and li leaving a lasting An impression. impression. Start to me is walking into a particular party or whatever and everybody says that spins that's right without doubting it's like a signature exactly leaving your name on your outfit i don't go to every event i don't go to everywhere where my name has got into today was my ashoke that took me there yeah you can walk into my store yes and tell me to give you exactly what someone else had won got you i'll tell you i'll, I'll start by just with you how far now from talking to you yeah you would know. Let's go back to the brand. Okay. How important has social media been to pushing your brand? Social media is so powerful. Mm. Even though I'm not a social media, media person, because you get away. so many views and yes. so many. Yes, I run away from it a lot. That's right. Social media has 
blessed my brand has blessed me yeah i've used my social media in a very positive way if i'm going to comment on your page it's going to be something positive, positive. and if just inspiring message, other people i'm going to say you're so beautiful yes if you are i don't think i've typed anything negative. negative so you've taken over social media what are the plans to take over the rest of the world i'm almost there okay what does the 24 mean in the bims means nothing means nothing bims 24 wasn't supposed to be my um, business page yeah because the actual name of the business is actually traditions by, by bims. bims that's right. then i go on instagram you know i was looking at type beams and that was taken and i just randomly put a number be behind it and it and it just blew. I had to register Beams 24. Yeah. Because when when I walk into a place, I got introduced at Beams 24. I was like, no, it's traditions by Beams. Yeah. If someone's write me a check, we'll be saying, no, that's not my business name. Yeah. So the the 24 at the back of my name means. You know what it can mean, actually? Mm -hmm. That you're on it 24-7. That's what we do now. Mm. So we can get your Ipili Angeli for you in 24, 24 hours. hours. We but can you ha get your stuff for you in 24 hours. That's, so that's right. That's the business we run now. That's so right. So when you call me, I need to say, like, how many hours have you got? Can yeah. I pick it up tomorrow? I'll give you the time. And that's right. It up tomorrow. I'm going to just send you an invoice for that idea. Because... <laughs> No, no, it's amazing. Before we leave you, tell us or tell all the young people watching, young ladies that want to get into the fashion industry, because you know the wedding industry especially is huge. It's a get billion big, dollar yeah. industry. How can they get their little slice? Just be you. Be truthful to you because that's the, very, that's the most important thing. Yeah. And stop looking at someone else's grass. Just don't, don't, that's, that's, and as you're coming into the industry, don't say you're coming because you want to come and outshine someone else. Yeah. You're coming to do you. You're coming to bring your name out there. You're coming to bring something new to the table. You're giving, you're about to launch what has never been seen before. Just do that. Be you. Being you will take you to a lot of places and being truthful. No one can tell you that, oh, because she's calling from London, I changed my eyes. Yeah. And again, um, for young people coming out there, mm -hmm. don't think because someone is buying you something worth of 3,000 naira, then you're treating them shabbily. Let me tell you, I treat my client the same. If you're spending 3 million and you're spending 3,000, I'm going to treat you like the you're spending way. three million. Because the three million clients would think, oh, it's because I'm spending three million, that's why I'm getting this treatment. But 3,000 clients, it's just a 3,000 client. Because the thing is, it's a lasting impression for that person. Yeah. She's going to go out and get me hundreds of clients because she's going to tell 10 of her friends and 10 of her friends will tell each and every of her friends. That's right. So treat your customers the same. But thank you so much for being on Fashion Insider. I mean, you've dropped gems pearls, diamonds, gold, like you've dropped so much knowledge. And I think it's yeah. just really nice for people to see who the person is behind, behind BIMS 24. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. I've never had this kind of interview. I'm going to say that again. I, I love you. I, I love the way it is. Um, I'm, Thank you. I get, I get tense whenever I'm about to do this, but you made me very comfortable. Thank you. Very, very comfortable. Thank you. That's what we do here on Indani and Fashion Insider. <laughs> Thank you so much for coming on. It's nice to meet you. Yes, nice to meet you too. Guys, it's been so yeah. great having the creative mind behind BIMS24 right here on Indani Fashion Insider. And I'm sure just by listening to her story, you've just been gingered, you know, to just go out and be the best version of you that you can possibly be. Now, if you've enjoyed this, you want to stick around and come back next week and next week and the week after. But make sure you follow us on all our social media platforms for more information on Fashion Insider. I've been your host, Sikao Se. See you next week.